Hello everyone, this is Tony Song, your president of the West Covina Rotary Club, and uh, this is the president's message for October 25th, 2010. So, um, this weekend, this uh, Saturday, was our big Red Ribbon Rally breakfast, uh, free breakfast event that we do every year for the last 20 years. And man, oh man, it was a success. Uh, we've had uh, people there before, but this weekend was incredible. We had lots of people show up um, to get some great breakfast, but also to learn about the, the event, uh, how it was created, as well as uh, enjoy all the entertainment that we had there. Uh, so it was a wonderful event. Thank you, everybody, uh, from, um, from, of course, Dave and Don, who is the uh, chair and uh, vice chair of the, uh, of the Red Ribbon Committee, uh, as well as all the other members of the committee um, and um, our fellow Rotarians that were there to participate in the event. Um, and, of course, we can't forget um, our Interact uh, Club, and they are a big part of what we did this weekend. Um, they showed up at 6 o'clock in the morning, uh, get things together, and uh, a lot of them stayed afterwards to help out uh, with the cleanup as well. So um, what a wonderful event. Thank you for, for being there, everybody that showed up. So last week we had a great presentation by Chuck Fritas from the Claremont Sunrise Rotary Club, and he came down. He talked to us about literacy and the programs that his, uh, his club is doing, and it really pumped us, uh, pumped us up and really got ex uh, our members excited uh, about literacy. You know, one of the things that we don't realize is that there is a literacy problem uh, within almost every community. And he outlined that for us. Uh, he, he told us about the problems that he's seen within his community and, and the projects that he, uh, he and his club created uh, to help out with that cause. So um, it's something that we should probably think of in the future for our club. I think it'd be a great opportunity for us to make a difference uh, in literacy within our community. So thank you, Chuck, very much for being, um, being our presenter last week and, uh, um, and opening up our eyes about the, this, this huge, huge problem of literacy uh, within our community and our children. So uh, thank you. Um, this week we have uh, Kathy Schlutz, um, and she will be presenting on ethics, and uh, she'll tie that into um, a rotary uh, project that we do, not our club, but um, a rotary project uh, that deals around um, uh, an eth eth ethics essay contest, and it's called the, uh, the Hensel Ethics Essay Contest. Say that three times. Um, but uh, she'll, be go she'll be talking about that project and how that works and how that develops ethics within our youth. So, wonderful program. Uh, don't miss it. That's this Wednesday. And the last uh, one thing that's coming up uh, this weekend on Sunday, which is Halloween, is that we're having our Westfields Halloween Community Outreach Project. And that's our club getting uh, in front of our community, just like we did in Red Ribbon Rally. We're going to be doing that at the, um, the Westfields Mall, and uh, they'll be uh, setting up a, uh, a table that we're going to present out crafts and um, our little craft uh, things that we're actually going to be creating this week in our Rotary uh, meeting. So please don't miss out on this meeting because you'll be a big part of getting that together for this, uh, this Halloween. Uh, but... The, the, the whole purpose of, of participating in this community event is so that we can get the word out about Rotary, about what we do, how we do things, and why we do things. So, um, and to inspire people to, to serve within their community, uh, whether it be through Rotary or whether it be through another service organization, we still need to make sure that they know that there are opportunities for them to be involved. Now, um, one of the things that we presented this weekend at Red Ribbon Rally, something that the, uh, the membership committee uh, led by Drexel Smith created was this little piece here. How about that? It's a trifold. It describes exactly what we've been doing, how we do it, and I think the most powerful part is this little area right here and part of the back, which are testimonials from our uh, membership. And so uh, we have Dave, uh, we have Yolanda, Forrest, uh, Lionel, and Tony's testimonials uh, of why they joined Rotary. And I think that's a big part of getting people to understand why they should join Rotary as well, or at least some type of service organization. So great job 
Drexel, thank you very much. And we'll be presenting this during our meeting so that everybody can see. Um, in fact, we used this this weekend, and we got, um, I believe, four uh, people that were very, very interested in our Rotary Club. So wonderful job, Drexel. Uh, the uh, membership committee, that's uh, uh, Ken as well. Um, thank you. Thank you very much for getting this done um, before the Red Ribbon Rally. We're going to be using this this weekend as well at the, um, at the, uh, uh, the, the Halloween uh, event. So thank you. And, and then the last thing is um, we have um, a birthday this, um, this uh, actually it's today, the 25th. Um, and um, uh, Ramon's wife, Erin, um, has her birthday today. So if you could, uh, if, if you do see uh, or talk to Ramon sometime today, uh, wish, uh, wish her a very happy birthday. Ramon, uh, please wish your wife a happy birthday and um, take her out, have a great dinner, uh, get her that diamond ring that she's been wanting. Okay? All right. Well, that's the, uh, the message for the week, and um, I'll see you on Wednesday. Have a great week.